TV10 and WRNR are proud to bring you this episode of Law Enforcement Live, recorded on the 1st of October, 2020. Thank you to Berkeley County Sheriff Curtis Keller for allowing us to give you this look into a day in the life of a law enforcement officer. This episode will feature a traffic stop, investigation of suspicious activity, an attempted serving of a fugitive warrant, and cleaning of roadside debris. Law Enforcement Live is filmed live with the men and women of law enforcement. All participants in tonight's show are innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. Viewer discretion is advised. You got anything illegal in the car? Alright, I'll grab that man.
gonna issue a warning for speeding. 55 and a 40. So if I catch for doing it again, it's gonna be a reckless driving ticket. So. driving to get 15 so slow down all right man all right. have a good night thank you this is finally charged up got a couple vehicles out here that's nice giving him a warning could have got him for reckless with that right yeah 15 overs reckless mm -hmm. man of course this dude pulled up
she offered a ride to her back here and dropped her off and I guess they deemed it as suspicious because of drug activity normally in the, in the area and yeah. so he got a little up in arms and they exchanged some, some words with regards to it so yeah. they're valid, there are no warrants so go back here and talk to this gentleman and let him know that you know, as long as there's not an issue with the female back here. That's why y'all have the best. Yeah, I figured. Are you going back there? I'll go back. So weird. Yeah. See him, Detective uh, Lukeman. I don't know if you guys know him. Lukeman? Luke Heckman. Heckman. Yeah, yeah him. Yeah. Uh, talked to him. I gave him the whole lowdown. I mean, yeah. I've got video footage of these people pulling in my driveway all hours of the night. Yeah. They're like, oh, we're here to see so and so, the guy that. As soon as they said they were here to see Tommy, I knew exactly what they were here for. He's like, you need to get out of here. She, they, I stopped him. She says, and, and take it at face value. She okay. says that the male that's in the car with her is her boyfriend who just got released from ERJ. She picked him up, and went to, she right. went to pick him up, and there was another female outside, and this female asked for a ride. And she said that she was doing the good deed to bring her down here. Bullshit. They, they, they were even telling me her name. Amanda is who the girl was that got out. Or Megan. They switched when I you know her last name? Huh? You know her last name? She didn't say. She, she kept saying, Megan's in that house right there. And I said, she ain't in that house right there. Yeah. No, yeah. there's nobody like them that lives in this neighborhood. But I'm, 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 Why did you turn her back here? Because they're know. waiting on the female that's up there to buy drugs. She walked around and she went over there. There's she nobody home there right now. She's up there hiding somewhere. And now there was another car that pulled in and it was there for like maybe two minutes. So I don't know. I didn't see anybody get in the vehicle. So she's up there somewhere. But I mean... It's it's getting stupid down this road, and all it is. If you see something coming from that house, I guess, I guess it's a drug house. Oh, yeah, no, that, that, one. House. Okay, that one. That house. That Nothing down here is like they, that. They don't know any. Why they're parked down there, I don't know. Yeah. Kind of odd. So when they were driving, they were driving really slow and creeping, and then. And when I went down there, he I said, out. what are you guys doing down here? They had all the doors open. He's in the back looking for something. I got a pistol right here, by the way. Okay. I'm I'm a retired Marine. I'm not gonna hurt nobody. I'm on your side. Um, and he's like, I said, what are you doing down here? He said, I'm looking for deodorant. And I was like, what are you looking for deodorant down here for? We don't know you, and yeah. I'm pretty sure you don't know anybody down here in any of these four houses. I said, because... That, that was my time. Okay, I just making sure. Sorry. I said, because <laughs> the, the way you guys are rolling, I, I said, people road down road here road make road. a lot of money. Oh. I said, and they're either cops, doctors, yeah. or the feds. Yeah. And you're in the wrong neighborhood. Oh, yeah. Yeah, further information So. I, that's what they're here. They're here buying drugs. I guarantee. I guarantee. I if you put a dog right. on that car right now, you'd right find there, something. You know no, I'm, I'm oh, guarantee. High school wasn't, but after high school, he's been down, down here and started using him. Because you just don't bring somebody to find Tommy. Yeah. No. Well, I'm gonna go down here and try and search a car. They're not down there having pot like that. Tell you. Yeah. Thanks, yeah. no. John. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. That was them with the pot. Too. Yeah. Hey, 
Jason, what are you guys doing back here? Literally, we just yeah, tried to uh, drop Megan off. Why'd you come back here? We told, because we she told her we were going to come back her, and pick her up. She said she had like to pick up her clothes. Him. And then we asked her if we could go pick her like up again because we have all her paperwork. Like, I just yeah. picked her up from the jail and stuff. That was it. What's your last name? Literally, we up. weren't doing anything wrong. Yeah, literally. Like, all she did was ask for a ride here, and then that was it. And then she left her papers in here. She got out at the same Megan time I did. Because I just got out, too. Yeah. Because I had a, What'd I had, you do? I had a KPS, Petty Larceny. The... It was from back, I don't remember when, like it was 2016. like... 2016. Yeah, it was like forever ago, I still got it going on. Like, we're not trying to do anything bad, we're not trying to get in trouble or nothing. Like, if we have to leave, that's fine, but I just want her to have her papers. Alright, you guys have anything in the car? No. no. Anything illegal? No. no. You guys mind if I search it? Well, there's nothing to search. I was about like, to say, I mean, she just said it was fine, if we leave, it's fine. I don't know, but if you guys got something in there you shouldn't have, I mean... No, I mean, we literally live in our vehicle. Yeah. I mean. Look, I'm just, I'm just trying to leave. Like, I'm, not, to leave. I'm not trying to get in trouble. Like, this I is just, her release paperwork, this man, yeah. girl. Yeah. She's walking down here. Is that? Like, is that's yeah. not her. Nah, it's not her. But is it okay if we just leave? Like, we literally didn't do nothing. If that's the case, we just leave. Like, we weren't trying to do anything wrong. I mean, I don't know if you want to keep the paperwork or. I mean, we can just keep it in it, here. It's her paperwork ain't my responsibility. Yeah, exactly. Just the same as and it ain't yours. Yeah, it's so. not ours. Yeah. What's she doing Which, up there? Is she picking up dope? No, we don't honestly, know. I she don't said know. She said she had to get clothes. That was like it. I said, she walked out in her sandals. She was naked sandals. when she came in to the jail. Literally, she walked out in her sandals. That was it. Uh, yeah, the sandals that the jail gave her. Which house is she at? That one. This one? She, we yeah. think she walked yeah. out. It's not, it's not that one. I don't know. That's just that's the where one that she like walked she by. That was all I know, honestly. Like, I don't even know this guy that she's meeting. What's his name? Tommy, she, she said, said Tommy. that was it. And that's all I know. Like, literally, I'm just trying to go home. But, I mean, which house did they say she went to? They say it's the one up there. It looked like she, the I thought she went to this Oh, well, house. then maybe that's why we thought she went there, because she probably went through the grass oh. or something. Because honestly, I don't know anything about it. She just asked if she'd get her clothes, and that was all I know. I was just trying to be a good Samaritan, yeah. a good friend. That was it. So you, but, so, I mean, so you guys were, so you guys dropped her off. Dropped her off. Yeah, left. she asked. No, no we, we left right because here. that dude, he, he was like just being like, ignorant to it. Yeah, like I, I told her the whole story. She was, he was like cussing at her and everything. I'm, and we I weren't just, even doing you know, anything. We were minding our own business on our phone. I was looking for food in the back. That's all I was doing. That's why I just grabbed the food and put it up on the front seat. I'm hungry. <laughs> I just got out of jail, so. And jail food's not very good. <clears throat> I mean, if we have to leave, that's fine. I'm not worried about doing yeah. all that if it's going to get me in trouble. What's she wearing? Uh, I know uh, black sweatpants, jail shoes. I can't remember her shirt, honestly. Take that with you. Obviously, she knows you in some way, shape, or form. She's yeah. got a fair number of stuff written down. So. Okay, you, you need to go. All right, that's, that's fine. fine. Like I, like like I said, said, we're not trying to cause any problems. Yeah. Just give him some viral ride. Like I said, I know how it is to, you know, have to leave. To walk. So. I can ride up here. You know exactly which house it is? Yeah. Let me ride up there and... And just tell her we got our papers. Gotcha. Whenever she can get it, she can get it. We're just going to leave because we won't get in trouble. Do you have your phone 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 phone. Phone. No. I have my phone. Tough. Alright. Alright. Sorry about Thank that.
person in 113. She got a call from a Karen Piss Snoggle public service, wondering if it's okay to pick up that phone. Turn to the experts. Your carrier factory authorized Going to be three zero four eight eight six four six zero five. He said it's his next house right here. I could have ever imagined. And I live in West Virginia, so you know I thought that would be a thing too. But it wasn't. That's where she went. Took care of it all. This next the next driveway is gonna be the house. Okay, thanks, man. Six tenths of mile. Six ten. Thank you. One thirty five Berkeley. One thirty five. Make sure they leave, I guess. So if with your caller and these individuals in the blue van again, they've been advised to leave the area. They're doing so now. B98 Airport. That's right. Stop. 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 What's up, buddy? Hey, I got a pee real quick. Right. Can I do that? Yeah, we're gonna do that. We're gonna serve a board here. Where? Who's it for? Fugitive board, Al Virginia. All right. Where's uh? Where's it at? Probation violation. Am I been the dude? Huh? What's his name? Or his last name? This one or the one? Someone's helping. 
parte de conteúdo. No. Oh. Nope, I didn't hear any movement either. Can't get a hold of this. Is this working to the car? That's what she said. It's a mixed house up. We'll go up here and top the hill and check that one there. Doesn't have a number on the door. Where's the mailbox at? There it is. It's across the street.
Glad you saved some of that road debris in case we need to plant a weapon on somebody later. <laughs> oh, I don't doubt there's gonna be more stuff up here. Dolly unicycle. Yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yeah, bunker. 